total lies in real estate. Number three, it's always better to have the sellers there and available for all showings. No, that's a terrible, terrible idea. You want the buyers to come in and feel like this is their new home and figure out where they're gonna put their furniture. They're not gonna do that in front of the sellers and some sellers can totally ruin a deal, make them feel like totally creeped out and be way too on top of them. Have you ever gone to a store where the salesperson is like Rrr! Yeah, you don't want that inside the home. I have literally turned down listings before because I knew the seller was gonna be like that and it was gonna reflect on me that I did a bad job instead of them being terrible, terrible sellers. If they're like that, ask them to go out to the back porch or ask them to not be there for the showings and it just makes the whole thing so much better. Once in a great while, having the sellers there, if it's raining cats and dogs out there, so be it. But generally speaking, you want the buyers to think of the house as theirs.